Hey guys, we're back. SEC Media Days Day 3 look back, but this time we're focusing on the players. I'm going to start things off with DeMarvin Leal. He's a big, big guy. I did get a one-on-one -on -one with him, but when he, when he was on the podium, he talked a little bit about how the Aggies are setting the standard early. Uh, heading into fall camp, we're just being able to just being able to get back together as a whole and getting after it is, is something I've been waiting for for a long time. And we're looking forward to setting our standard and showing our standard and just showing how the culture in Aguilar has changed. Another thing DeMarvin Leal talked about a lot today was the fact that defense wins championships. The Aggies had pretty good defense last year, but he expects them to set the standard even higher in 2021. Our defense is able to represent in a fantastic way because defense is what wins championships. So coming to A&M as a whole, we already knew what it was going to be and what the expectations were, not only for ourselves, but for the 12th man. Defense means everything to our 12th man, and just being able to make them proud is a blessing. All right, one of the questions with the Aggies is that offensive line, Kenyon Green, obviously one of the better offensive linemen in the entire country, maybe the best in the country, maybe the best in the SEC. He talked a little bit about that line coming together, but not looking ahead, um, thinking about the moment and not thinking about the past with the college football playoffs last year that they were not invited to. Well, we had a great season last year, but, you know, we focus on this season and what we can do um, this year. You know, we got to make sure we win every game this year. Make sure we can get to that common goal again, you know, get to the national championship. Let's talk a little bit about that quarterback room. It is always a hot button issue with the Aggies. Obviously, they had quarterback for so long. Now they have two guys trying to battle for it. How about that quarterback spot? If you ask Kenyon Green about it, if it's Haynes King, if it's Zach Calzada, doesn't matter. They're going to rally around their guy, and that offense is going to be deadly. Yes, um, the quarterback room is working extremely hard right now. Um, I'm proud of all of them, you know, um, whoever get the job. You know, they deserve it because it's, you know, it's not easy because it's, it's really it's a, it's a great battle going on right now. All right, that's going to wrap up the SEC Media Days look back of day three, this time with the players. I did get a couple of one-on-ones. Hopefully you'll check those out as well. And we'll continue our coverage tomorrow, day four of SEC Media Days. Then we're back in studio. For Richard, I'm David. We'll see you guys on TexAgs.com.